Okay, we got a 450 Holly here with electric choke, 4548. Look at this linkage real close. This linkage here, you cannot hook anything to it below this. This is your auto. This is your kick down apparatus for your automatic if you need that. It's got that. It's got a knob on here for your linkage, but if you need anything that hooks down here, you don't have it. As far as vacuum lines, how many vacuum lines has it got? One vacuum line right here for the distributor. So if you need a vacuum thing for for uh, brakes and parachute and ejection seat and wipers and heater, it ain't got it. It's got that. That's for your thing. Now we're going to crank it up. Here's your electric choke. When you get it, if you want to put the choke on, even though it's 100 degrees out, you loosen up those three screws. Turn that black cap until that thing right there touches, just like that. Tighten the three screws back up and it'll be choking, even if it's 100 degrees out. You guys are not happy unless you got a choke. When we started up, we've already got this mixture set here and here. We've already got the float set by adjusting it here to this level there. You don't need to mess with that. We got the mixture set right here at 12 parts of air to one part of gas. And as we accelerate, it gets thinner. That's the way a carburetor is designed. And we make them to work like that. <coughs> 450 CFM with a Ford kick down. <coughs> Excuse me, with the electric choke. Dang, now you look at this little doodad here. See that little red dot? That means that computer is real busy inside there. It's calculating all the exhaust. It's calculating the mixture and the setting. It's calculating this carburetor. Not not calculating the engine, it's calculating this carburetor and how it performs according to the exhaust stuff it puts out the back. <coughs> Put this carburetor in any motor and it will do the same thing. That it, it, it's the carburetor being calibrated. As you see, it's a perfect 12. We're going to wrap it up. See it get lean? At the back. At the back. Back barrel. At the back barrels you heard kicking in, and you've seen the mixture get lean. Carbur the car doesn't need as much liquid gas to push it along as rich a mixture because it's overcome inertia. All right, we're going to put it on there and sell it. These are pretty pretty good material, pretty good, uh, pretty good merchandise.